Tip number one, decide your moving timeline. If you are renting, you should ask yourself, when is your lease up? Are you allowed to sublet? And if you currently own a home, are you desiring to keep your home as an investment or will you be selling it? The value of your home can determine the amount of equity you have in your home. Contact a local real estate professional for assistance. Researching the local days on the market can assist in determining the average amount of time your home may be on the market. And lastly, are there any upcoming seasonal financial incentives such as grants or loan programs that you will need to consider? These factors will help you determine when you should move. And tip number two, get your finances in order. Contact a lender and get pre-approved for a mortgage. Your mortgage professional will review your credit report and be sure you have enough money to cover your down payment and closing costs while taking into consideration any equity you have in your current home. This will save you the headache later of falling in love with a house that you cannot afford. Tip three, research before you look. Decide what features you want to have most in a new home, what areas you prefer, and how much you would be like to spend per month on housing. Location is very important in real estate as you cannot change the location of your home after you buy it. Research the commute times of your favorite destinations, such as work, school, family, and friends. Tip four, be realistic. It's okay to be picky, but don't be unrealistic with your expectations. There's no such thing as a perfect home. Use your list of priorities to guide you and evaluate each problem. Tip number five, don't ask too many people for opinions. It'll drive you crazy. Select one or two people to turn to if you feel you need a second opinion, but be ready to make the final decision on your own. Tip number six, think long-term. Are you looking for your first home with plans to move up in a few years, or do you hope to stay in this home for a longer period? This decision may dictate what type of home you'll buy, as well as the type of mortgage terms that will best suit you. Tip number seven, always have a home inspection. A home inspection is a visual examination of a home from the roof to the foundation. An inspection can alert you to potential problems with the property and allow you to make an informed decision. Every aspect of a home can be inspected. However, sometimes other types of inspections may be desired or required depending on each buyer's particular scenario. Other types of inspections can also include radon, pests, mold, well water, septic, or mold. Tip number eight home warranty. A buyer can purchase a home warranty for their new home. The cost of a home warranty can begin at $450 and go up from there depending on the level of coverage and the total term of the warranty. Tip number nine, get help from a realtor. Hiring a real estate professional as they specialize in buyer representation. A realtor can assist in recommending a variety of different services such as local vendors, various home inspectors, title companies, insurance agents, closing companies, contractors, and more. Working with a realtor also brings about experience as most agents have assisted many buyers doing a similar transaction as yours.